What about this? Harvey Elliott, I think, he's spoken about that challenge at Ellen Road yep. at the weekend, uh, Simon. On Instagram, Harvey, of course, uh, suffered a dislocated uh, ankle in the challenge from Leeds United's Pascal Stroik. But Stroik was uh, red carded uh, after the challenge. Mm-hmm. Um, poor old Harvey ended up in hospital he's had surgery he says on Instagram never was it a red card just a freak accident but these things happen in football I'll be back stronger 100% thanks for all the support and as well as that he gave his shirt to another kid in the yep. same ward in the hospital which I thought was magnificent but what does that tell us about Harvey's character and, and how he's handled this situation himself um, it tells us that he's a young man of substance yeah, um, I'm. I'm aware of him. I spoke about him about a year ago because his agent is someone I know quite well and was raving on about him. And and I've watched him. And I mentioned him on a show about eighteen months ago. What a player I thought he was going to be. So it's no surprise to me that he's come to the fore. I mean, ultimately he's had a, an injury. He's young enough to know that he's going to bounce back from it. He also understands that um, the reach that he has because the, giving someone a shirt, whilst it's it's. It's a gesture that probably doesn't cost him much to do, but to have the thought to do it, I think, shows the the, the integrity this young man has. We talk about footballers sometimes as being very self-centred, selfish individuals that don't really focus on anybody but themselves, which they, which is true because you have to go with the territory of being that way. But to come out and to, to nip the furore in the bud, to know that a fellow professional didn't do it on purpose and to be able to not so much absolve him of the responsibility but to give some some feedback against an, a media narrative that was building up at certain segments about this challenge what yeah, it looked like yeah, and so on and so forth yeah. I just think it's a, it's a it's a good story from a very decent young man that probably will go on to be quite a substantial footballer yeah, not just simply because of his ability but because of his character and you want to see character These, this is this is the kind of thing that leaders should be made of yes yeah but so what, what cars they drive and, and what girls they date and which nightclubs they go to mm. and where they holiday um, but this kind of reaction to adversity and the uh, the 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 the, the, the the disposition of saying I can give my shirt to a kid in a bed that might be worse off than me because I might, I know I've got the best surgery I've got the best support mechanisms I'm going to be fine and I'm going to do something meaningful for him yeah, and by the way that. also I'm I going to talk that. about a fellow pro and make sure that he doesn't get a hard time he doesn't psychologically suffer for an injury that he didn't mean to inflict upon me Yeah. so well done commendable and a very valuable member of society and well certainly done, football Harvey. society and if you're listening this morning no doubt still bedridden we wish you well Jim White and Simon Jordan, Monday to Thursday morning, 10 till 1, on AM, on DAB, via the TalkSport app, and on your smart speaker, TalkSport.